wait for it. Light bulb. Check out the name tag. You're in my world now, Grandma. What's up, nerds? And have I got a story for you. So down below, you can find the article that I read to bring you this video. And you can read it for yourself or you can just listen to this video because I'm going to read it for you right now. Um, before I get started, also, I just want to say that if you like what I do here and you enjoy independent content here on YouTube, please consider subscribing to my channel. YouTube is always changing up their algorithm and small channels like mine, we always get shoved to the back of the line. So please ask that you like, share and subscribe and I thank you in advance. So now that we've got that out of the way, let's go ahead and get started. Captain America number four has found its director. That's right, you guys. And it's Julius Ona. Uh, it says Anthony Mackie stars in the feature, which hails from Falcon and the Winter Soldier head writer Malcolm Spellman. Um, I don't know if it'll be good. That show was not uh, that great, in my opinion. Um, and I, I don't, I don't know. I have thoughts, but I don't know how to like uh, about marvel and the direction they're going because i just don't think they understand but it's it's like whatever anyways normies will love it because normies eat up everything because they're stupid anyway so it says captain america 4 has a director Woo! nigerian american uh filmmaker julius ona perhaps best known for helming the 2018 uh, thriller the cloverfield paradox which is not something you want to be that's what you want to be best known for uh because that movie sucked will direct the fourth installment of captain america film franchise for marvel studios anthony mackie is starring in the feature reprising his long time marvel uh character of sam wilson but not however wilson's longtime alter ego and captain america sidekick falcon that is thanks to the events of 2021's Marvel Disney Plus series, Falcon and the Winter Soldier, which saw Wilson, after much self-doubt, finally accepting the shield and mantle of Captain America. Mm, which, like I said before, that show was not very good, in my opinion. Like, it was okay. Um, but they just did a lot of dumb stuff in that show. And, uh, yeah, yeah. And I, like, I'm sorry, but... but I like, I love, I just want to say, I love Anthony Mackie. He is such a good actor, but I think they should have kept him as the Falcon because I loved him as Falcon and him as Captain America. I don't know. We'll see. I'll watch it, but I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. I, it's one of those things. Anyways, it's not known what the paths of the character will be next, but something uh, thought provoking is likely. I doubt it. I mean, that series was not thought provoking. If that's, if that's what they thought they did, they, they are not good at thinking. Anyways, um, Malcolm Spellman, the creator uh, and head writer of Winter Soldier, is penning the script with Dalin Musan, a staff writer on the show. Good for them. It is unclear whether Chris Evans would reprise his role as Steve Rogers, a.k.a. the first Captain America, America although if the question of who is entitled to carry S.H.I.E.L.D. continues to be posed... All bets are off. Plus, having stacked casts in solo movie outings is a main Marvel ingredient at this point. No start date has been revealed. I just want to say, I, I just I read a thing like online somewhere that Chris Evans is not going to do Captain America anymore. He's like, no, it's it's Falcon's turn to carry the shield, and I'm all like, mm, does that mean you can't? be in any more movies just not carry the shield like I'm, I'm i'm very confused about that whole thing but we'll see we'll see ona was born in uh mark Kudri, i don't know nigeria and lived in local uh locales around the world thanks to a diplomat parent before settling in the u.s his shorts made the festival rounds while his new uh, nyu film school thesis movie attracted spike lee as an exec producer jj abrams tapped him to direct a feature set in the producer's cloverfield uh, world and while that studio movie misfired he gained strong notices for his return to his roots rebound in a 2019 indie drama loose mm. the neon movie starred naomi watts tim roth kevin da 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 uh debuted in a sundance it garnered three indie spirit award nominations including best director then it says who he is. Uh, so this is what I have to say about that. Good for him. Um, 
I wish him nothing but the best. Uh, you know, I mean, and this is great news for him. I hope it turns out, you know, I, I don't know, man. Marvel for me personally has just not been the best lately. Uh, I, I just, you know, um, from the TV shows to the movies, they've all been very mediocre for me. Uh, especially this last one, Thor, Love and Thunder. I'll have to, I'm trying to do write out my notes for my review right now, but it's been very difficult lately. But um, I just want to say like, I, I have high hopes, but uh, you know, I, I don't think they're going to meet my, my hopes and everything. What do you guys think about all of this? How do you feel about the Captain America 4 getting a director in Julius Ona? Um, you know, have you seen his movie uh, Loose? or Lucy, Luce, I don't know how to say that. But anyways, um, did you see that or did you not see it? I didn't see it. Um, but, uh, and how do you feel about this? Do you think this movie is going to be good? Do you think it's not going to be good? What do you think about all that stuff and, and the direction Marvel is taking? Tim, what you guys think? Go ahead and leave all your comments in that section down below. If you like this video, go ahead and hit that like button. You know, I won't mind. If you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button. I'd greatly appreciate it. If you want to help out, you can also hit the uh, the thanks button. Um, that's down there by the like button. Hit both of them. Just click, click. You can really help the channel out. If not, I get it. It's totally cool. Um, and I will see you guys uh, next week. You guys have a good week. Bye.